so here I am with my two babies. My newest baby, um, Mr. Lux. Say hi. Say hi, Lux. And my oldest, Mr. Taj. Say hi, Taji. Hi, Taji. Hi. Taj is a Bijan. And if you didn't guess it, Lux is a Rottweiler. He is 10 weeks. We just got him. I just got him two weeks ago. And it's feeding time. It's lunch time for Lux. So we're about to go. Eat. <laughs> and I'm going to show you the food that I buy for Lux as well. So just hold tight, okay? outside handling their business and I am about to get Lux lunch ready. I actually just got back in from picking up his meat from the meat shop. He's on a raw diet so all of his stuff is raw. I'll actually show you some of the stuff that I got for him. So this is everything that I picked up for Lux today. We have some lamb for some stew but he's not gonna eat no stew. Yeah, there's this. I think this is pork liver. A sirloin tip beef. What else? Some pork tips. Some more tips. We got some pork heart. I believe this is pork heart. Yep. These beef bones. He's a little too young for those. So I'll probably give him a little one just so he can get used to chewing on them. Because he's chewing on every fucking thing else. What else? We got some chicken gizzards and chicken necks. He loves chicken necks. And he loves heart and he loves liver. He loves every fucking thing at this point. But this is what it looks like when I package it up. Here we have some heart. Here we have some liver as well and some ground beef. And I'm probably going to throw some, um, some rib tips in there as well. Just so he can have some bone. Supposed to be like 80% meat, 10% bone, 10% organ. I don't really measure it out. I just throw it in there, but he loves it. So just one second, I'm about to get this together. Hold on, I'll be back. So here's everything. It looks a little big right now. I mean, it is a lot of food. He didn't have a big breakfast, but we have some. Here's the heart that I cut up. Liver, some ground beef, and some rib tips. And whatever he don't eat, I'll just package up and put in the refrigerator for later. Sit. Sit. Sit down, Lux. Good boy. Eat. Yeah. When he's eating, you know, I always just try to rub him, pet him, just so he's used to getting rubbed on while he's eating. No, no food aggression or anything. I'll even put my hand in his bowl. Mess with his food. He used to growl. Now he don't anymore. So that's a good thing. Taj is over there doing whatever Taj does. Hi, Taji. Taj is four. He's my Bijan. He's my baby. Spoiled as can be and bougie and dirty right now, as you can see. He's a haircut. And Lux just turned 10 weeks. He'll be 10 weeks Friday, actually. Then. Hush. No. You're embarrassing me on camera, bro. <laughs> As you can see, he loves his food. And while he's in there doing it, while he's eating, I'll go in here 
and show you the rest of his food he already has. This is the OG. Oh, Josh. So this is what he has left of the food that I bought. Some more chicken liver, ground beef. Here's some beef liver back there. And this is actually some prepackaged dog food that they already have. It's grounded up. So he eats that as well. I think these, this might be something that I put together already. I think this is some beef heart with some ground beef and some liver. I think that's all the same. I got to fit some bone in there as well. But I'm about to package all of this up and freeze it. And that's that. Then we'll go out and play with Luxembourg. So I'll be back. that I didn't get any chicken breasts. This is all what lamb with bone, so loin rolls, pork heart, rib tips, so loin, pork heart. But yeah, I'm gonna go to the store later and get some chicken breasts so he can have that as well. And then, uh, he ate good. Hi Lexi. Hi. You ready to come in? You ready to come in? And I'll just package this up for later. It's so crazy how much he's grown since I got him. It's only been two weeks. And I love how calm he is. He's just like the most calm dog in the world. Him and Taj both are just like so calm. Ain't that right, Luxie? Ain't that right, Lux? He's gonna be a beast. I think we start some puppy training, some obedience training next week. So I'm excited for that. Because he is a little stubborn. Can be a little stubborn at times when we're going on walks. And when I tell him to come. But lately he's been, been doing really good at following Taj. Following Taj around, doing everything Taj is doing. So he's been doing really good at coming and walking on his leash. Isn't that right, big boy? Isn't that right? All right, guys. I am going to be back. We just got back. I went out to run some errands, get some food. And while I was out, I got called in to work tonight. So unfortunately this video won't be as long as I wanted it to be and it won't cover everything I wanted it to cover. But I just was wanted to introduce you guys to the puppies, to one puppy, one dog. And yeah, so tomorrow Lux has to go to the vet get a second round of vaccines so you guys will be able to see that say hi Lux hi 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 say hi Taji Taj Mr. Taj We're about to go in here and take a nap because it's about that time. Usually when I have to work, they take a nap around, we take a nap around two o'clock, between two and three. And then Lux will have dinner between five and 5.30 before I leave out at 6.30. So,
and that's it for the day. Gosh, it's so dirty. All right, guys. See y'all later. We just woke up from our nap. <sighs> I'm so tired. Lux is eating his last meal of the day. These meals he get full really quick. Who are you barking at? Hmm? Who are you barking at? And Taj, he just eats whenever he's ready. His bone is in the house. Hi, Daddy. What's up? Just giving y'all a little end of the day routine. Taj is like, I'm out. This boy is annoying. Taj is gone. All right. Say goodnight, guys. I gotta get ready for work.
guys are just wondering what I'm doing. Okay, I'm gonna go. I'm gone. Good night.